this game and a favourable result elsewhere will see them reach the knockout stages. Live coverage next on EA TV. Well, the weather forecasters promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is the second group stage match here at Euro 2024 for the two teams. It's Germany versus Hungary. Well, Derek, both teams played really well last time out, but something has to give here today. I'm looking forward to this one. It should be a great contest. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer between the posts. Jonathan Tarr plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And here's the 11 for Hungary. Well, in this 4-5-1 shape, it will be interesting to see how close the wide midfield players get to their main striker. Will they stay wide or play through the inside right and inside left positions? We'll have to wait to see how it develops. Cross with the corner. And the keeper left us in no doubt that that was always going to be his ball. Attila Salai. Well, as we've already made note of, here is the scenario for the visitors on this occasion. Stewart, can they secure their place in the knockout stages? Well, all they have to do here is worry about themselves. Play well, get a good win, and then look at the result in the other fixture. And quite simply, wide of the target. Kalmar. Callum Styles. Slipshod passing. Wirtz. Well, no stopping him. And slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan. But can't avail himself of the chance. Will he be disappointed with that? Maybe it's just come a bit too early for him. chance to do damage could cross it in here real chance oh that's textbook goalkeeping well we always talk up Jamal Musiala and with good reason has terrific skill and good luck to his opponents well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the boxes. Will he find the net? Well, catching it sweetly, but not quite the accuracy he was looking for. Well, it's always a difficult technique on the volley, but I think that's a massive chance he should score from. Callum Styles, Shalai. That's a good pass, and nicely parried away. Andri, Gundogan. Hungary recovering possession well. Now can they make something happen? 
Adam. Real chance. Oh, that's a fine save. Viet. Gundogan. Well, the fans want to see a shot. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. Well, you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek. They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. And looking to apply further pressure from this position. Can they get themselves in front here? In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. The ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, I'm sure the replay will confirm he got a touch on this, which he does. So he'd be really upset that he didn't keep it out. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Martin Adam, Kalmar, well it's a decent looking attack this, well that effort was always going wide, he's not going to be best pleased with himself. Tony Kroos. Gundogan. Now a good tackle. Moving forward effectively. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Can they hit on the break? Can they use their pace? Must score! And there is the goal! He's found the net! Joy unconfined! Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. So on with the action, and I must say it's been a thorough masterclass from Germany so far, and you sense it's a question of how many. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And just wide of the post with the header. Jamal Musiala and Gundogan untidy with the ball at his feet Nagel
and Havertz. Takes it on! And that's a very good parry. Chance here! Well, it was close to the target, but close isn't good enough, really. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. Well, totalling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. And a significant block following that cross. So, a corner here. Who can he pick out? And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, what a display from him. Lots of touches, some great passes and an assist. He's been absolutely brilliant today. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Trying to open up the defence. Couldn't grab hold of it. He's blocked it. Hungary will get the throw in. And credit due, a good intervention. Now perhaps they can counter from here. Kai Havertz. Gundogan. Here's Cross. Cleared away comprehensively. And a quick reminder, we have plenty of live football in store for you right here on EA TV. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Nagel and Hungary come away with it Maximilian Mittelstedt could be a goal that's two for him today they simply can't stop him no wonder he's celebrating well, here it is again. Havertz goes past his man so easily, and Havertz finish gives the keeper no chance. He hits it with such venom. This is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Milos Kerkes. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end.
Well, it's just about a case of wall-to-wall -wall football live with us here on EA TV. And Stuart and I will be with you for this game coming up. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in what should be a really feisty affair. Kimmich. Gundogan. And it's with Mittelstedt. Nicely timed tackle. And a throw in for Hungary. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Musiala and danger averted well read well using the space really well but now can they push on as ice for goal oh did so well to deny him so making the substitution now He's driven in the corner. Now too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Fulkrug. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Callum Styles, And he has options available. And the pass not finding its target. Breaking at pace. Defenders need to cover. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Loic Nagel. Well, a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Great opportunity. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Attila Salai. Tony Kroos. 
He's in behind. And that's a very good parry. A concession of a corner here. Fired over by Kroos. Nagel. Sobosloy. Good through ball. Germany with the ball once again. Wirtz. Raum. Here's Phil Krug. Might work out. Can he put it away? A goal! He's dispatched it. Much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Musiala. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. But a good piece of tidying up. What's he going to do here? Muda. Well, putting it wide from there. Disappointing. Message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Müller. That's a well-struck pass. Happy to take on the shot. It was on its way in. A decisive clearance it was. Phil Krug. Head over towards the back post. And the final whistle, the big story here, Germany have prevailed. Stuart, your analysis. Well, outplayed, outpassed, and at times overrun, but they rode their luck and scored when it mattered. It's a great result for them. Well, one thing we often say about Kai Havertz is that he's so very hard to silence, and that was the case in this game. Sum up his contribution for us. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today, and, of course, he scored two really good goals.